Deputy Prime Minister and Minister of Finance Peter Turnquist has resigned from the cabinet. Prime Minister the Most Honorable Dr. Hubert Minnis confirmed the move in a statement yesterday afternoon, noting that he has accepted the minister's immediate resignation. The Prime Minister thanked Mr. Turnquist for his service to the Bahamas, especially during the COVID-19 pandemic. Prime Minister Minnis announced that he will serve as the interim Minister of Finance and will make an appointment in due course. Mr. Turnquist released a statement shortly after the announcement explaining that he's confident that once the allegations against him have been fully ventilated through the courts, his reputation of transparency and accountability will be vindicated. He explained, however, that he did not want a private business dispute to become a distraction for the government. Mr. Turnquist also noted that he will continue to serve out of the term as a member of parliament for East Grand Bahama. Mr. Turnquist said it had been his honor to serve his country in public office and that he has done so with total fidelity and adherence to the tenets of our democracy. Free National Movement Chairman Carl Kalmer thanking the former Minister of Finance for his service to the country in the cabinet the past three and a half years. The FNM National Chairman boasted that when the Free National Movement came to office in 2017, Mr. Turnquist went to work to help restore the country's finances and did a commendable job during his tenure in office in the face of unprecedented back-to-back -back crisis. The FNM Chairman says he respects the decision by Turnquist to resign from cabinet to abide by the conventions of our system. The resignation follows the revelation that Turnquist was named in a Supreme Court writ filed late last week, which included allegations of impropriety, though Mr. Turnquist was not named as a defendant and has denied any wrongdoing.